Hey, it's Chef Big Bang. Today we are going to be making bean dip. It is going to be so delicious. Perfect for game day, perfect for the holidays, or for any fam family gathering that you are having. This dip is always a great addition. So we're going to grab our ingredients and we're going to get started. Let's go, guys. First, my first ingredient is you need a can of refried beans. Super yummy. Come on, guys. Let's go get started. From Ava's Playtime. Hello. Say hey. It's way up there. <laughs> hey. Hi. So today we are making our delicious bean dip, which is great for game day, great for holidays, or any type of family gathering that you have. So. Yes. So we got our beans right here we got our cream cheese right here we have our cumin as well so and we have our mini and we have our cheese pie. yes and we have our mini crock oh, i forgot something the salsa we also i forgot the salsa <laughs> so let me <laughs> grab that so we also have our salsa. So we have to put all the ingredients to mini crock pot. Yes, yeah, so we're gonna put all those ingredients in the tiny crock pot. Let's take all of them and put a there. Yeah. Okay, so the first thing we're gonna do, we're gonna take our can opener. We are gonna open our beans. Beans. And can you get a spoon out? Because we're gonna have to scrape these out with a spoon. Because these beans are stubborn. Can I get a big one? Yes, get a big spoon. And you can get your, bring your stool too so that you can uh, turn that light on. So, yes, this bean dip is really, really tasty. Hold on, Ava. I'm going to put it over there in that corner. So, this bean dip is really, really tasty. Yes. And I left this cook in the crock pot. And the great thing about this recipe is that you can just eat it with chips. It is so yeah. good. You have the chips in here. I'm going to pour the juice in there first. So... Be very careful with the juice. If you're dealing with, this might slip out. I don't know. See, what I tell you guys, stubborn. So go ahead and scoop the beans into the pot. All of it? Yes, all of it. This is why I have a stack. I don't know what I'm doing. Oh, I got happy. <laughs> Let's put it in there. Just a few seconds. This is why you watch style seven grade. Yes. Okay. Ugh. 
Okay, so we have all of our beans in the crock pot now. Next step is we are going to put the cheese into the crock pot. And the recipes are going to be, the recipe is down below. So, so do these two. I'm going to hand the cheese to my helper. Let her dump the cheese in there. And this recipe is a lot of cheese. So we're putting shredded cheese in there. And we're going to put cream like cheese. cheese in there as well. So I'm going to hand that to my helper. All right, so the next thing we're going to do is this. We got, got right. Philadelphia cream cheese. And we're just going to put this whole thing inside of that crock pot. So you can also call this dip crack bean dip. That's fine too. Whatever There's you want to call it. Of what? Yes, yeah, so we're just going to. And as you guys can see, that's cream cheese. We're going to dump this whole thing into here. Wow. Maybe it's on the toilet. Yeah. And I'm going to plug this in and we're going to let it start kind of getting warm. Getting warm here. Gonna put this on low because you don't want your bean dip to get too hot. If it gets too hot, it hey, the the cheese can start to separate and start to curdle and look very nasty. So you want to cook it on low. Low. That's right. Okay. There. So let me take you guys over to the bean dip and let me show you guys what's in there so far. We have our refried beans. And our cream cheese. cream cheese. And we have our helper right there. So the next thing that we are going to do, we are going to put the salsa in there. Well, I agree it's in a small pot. Yes. And I'm going to pour this over the sink so that if any spills, I'll do this step, Ava. Watch out. Step down real quick. So we're going to add salsa into here as well. And as you guys can see, this pot is full of stuff. Yeah, I agree. It's full of stuff. Cooks and gets warm. It's gonna be super, super tasty. So, super, super full. And let me go over to my cookbook here, Big Bang Cooking, and see what what is left. Okay, so we have to add the cumin and the chili pepper, right, Ava? That is the cumin. Oh. So we're gonna add a little bit to the pot. Because we want too much. And the recipes are down below in the description about how to make my famous bean deal. So we're just gonna sprinkle a little bit in there. Can like I put that. Over there? I'll do this one. You can do the other one though. Okay. It was in the cabinet the whole time. Ooh, we gotta dig this one out. Okay, so we also have chili powder, really good, great ingredients to have if you are making Mexican food or any type of food like that. So you can just sprinkle a little bit in there, Ava. That's good. Go ahead and put the lid back on there. Okay, so we have all our, our ingredients inside. We are gonna give this a quick stir. Do you guys see it? We're gonna give that a quick stir. No, I'm gonna do it, Ava. I got it, Ava. We're gonna um, give this a quick stir, put the lid on, let this cook for about two hours. We're gonna come I back. Thought, I thought I thought it was the other one. We're gonna let this cook for like two hours. And you wanna cook oh, this on eight low. Two hours in total. 
Yes, we're gonna let this cook for two hours. You wanna put this on low heat. We're gonna taste them when we come back. So, and you can just dip your chips right into here and eat this dip. It is so good. And already I can tell you guys, it smells wonderful. It smells so good, Bob. It smells great. So the reason why you shop can really hot though, because if I have to burn down the house down, and then that would be super bad. Now I'm tell you. Mm -hmm. I'm tell you. These ingredients together oh, is delicious. so delicious. I think the only reason why I don't make this dip a lot is because I'll eat it all. I'll eat it all. It's just so good. And then when you mix the chips with it, it's even better. So, I can tell it. that's it for this episode. When it gets done, I will show you guys the finished product. But until then, me and my helper... We'll see you guys later. It's been like eight hours. We'll see you guys later. Bye, bye. bye. So it's all done after about three hours cooking on low heat. And then you serve this dip with chips. And it is so delicious. So, I'm going to start it around for you guys. Let you guys see how this is so good. I don't know if you guys ever have had bean dip. But it's definitely amazing. Definitely amazing. So, you serve this with chips. And even by itself, it is yummy. So, I'm going to show you guys how I serve this and I'm gonna tell you why for you guys so here we go so when you get the small crock pot these are always good to have just in case you never know when you're gonna have a family gathering super delicious the recipe is in the description please hit the like button Subscribe to my YouTube channel, learn how to cook, and learn great recipes. Okay, so here it is, you guys. All done. So I got my dip, my bean dip over here, and I got my chips over there. So, uh... Super, super tasty. And just and dip it in here. So good.